What is going on guys, Judo Sloth here and welcome to today's Brawl Stars series. That is right, we are back on the Brawl Stars content. It's not that I haven't been playing the game, it's just that I felt I was doing more Brawl than Clash content. And you guys are mainly Clash of Clans fans, that's what I've built my channel on. So I wanted to get back on a regular schedule with that before we integrated the Brawl Stars content again. So we're going to continue with lots of tips and trick videos. Videos, and we are going to be doing this series which is basically farming my account up to a maxed level right now I have unlocked all of the brawlers apart from Colt and Leon still waiting of them legendary brawlers we do have spike and we do have some of the brawlers to maxed level we're also going to be trophy pushing myself the band that I am in is slothy slayers now we are going to be trying to improve as a band but it is going to be about enjoying the game so if you want to join you're more than welcome I will be playing with friends a lot of the time but I do want to improve my own game as well whilst bringing you the tips and trick videos so if you want to come and join us feel free to try and help us improve let's get into the first episode for today then you will note that i have a lot of gem boxes we will be opening them next episode we'll call this episode one if you will be sure to subscribe if you want to see all of my brawl stars content so we have gem grab showdown heist and brawl ball let's get into gem grab first Pam is probably one of my favorite brawlers and basically as Pam I want to sit in the middle of the map protect the rest of my team get my healing station up that is it we do have someone watching us as well I wonder if that's someone in my band or one of my friends see if we can outrange bull here and let's just see where we go from here so what I also want you guys to do drop down in the comment section that turret got taken straight out drop down in the comment section if you like the cam overlay obviously I have it in the bottom right hand corner at the moment it kind of obstructs the joystick but other than that it's not very obstructive of the gameplay and honestly I think it's the best place to have it let me know though let me know what you think down in the comments if we can get this player out nearly should be good from there Tara has a super so let's just back out of there can't believe she pulled me into that oh man I thought we dodged that, I really did, and I thought we were going to get Bull there, we had that in the bag, didn't quite happen, okay, let's see, let's put the turret here, try and get around to get that Pam, which we did, let's just get some damage onto Bull there, he's backed off, which he probably shouldn't have, let's maybe just nip one more gem, why not, give us a little bit extra of a safety net, I don't want to drop too far back here, mainly because we're in control. So when we get to the last few seconds, it gives me room to back off, which my teammates should probably do. So if you back off too early and you back yourself right into the edge of the map, what it means is you've got nowhere else to back off to and essentially waste time. If you wait them few seconds whilst we had control, we weren't in any danger, then in the last few seconds we could drop back and we knew the game was safe. I didn't get star player. What's happening with that? I don't know. Let me know in the comments if you think I got star player. I know these guys want to play again, but for the Let's Play episodes, what I'm going to probably do is rotate the gameplay. So we will start with, you know, the one in the top left and move from there. So we have Showdown. What map is it? So there's a lot of walls and things there. I like to play Bull in Showdown. I really do. I think sometimes when you have the higher level brawlers, you can get away with a few stuff as well. So if you make some mistakes, you can kind of back off and get your health back. So we have a box here. Just make sure there's not a brawler sitting there waiting at me. And basically, guys, honestly, it goes without saying you want to get as many of these boxes straight away as you can. Just can't quite get that bow and bow will outrange us as well. So I need to basically back out of this situation. Essentially, it's always understanding when you have the advantage and when you don't. Dowell used his super there, and these guys are going to get themselves low on health. Ah, well played getting away, to be honest. Right, where are we at? Who's in the middle here? This Daryl, uh, not Daryl, this boar is still pursuing us, and I do know that... Where did Daryl go? He's sitting in the bushes here somewhere. Boar, get away from me, come on. You made me run the entire map. Let's see if we can trap Daryl in here. We got another bull, but with seven energy. I'm getting out of there. I don't particularly recommend 
not getting into firefights. I, I definitely don't recommend hiding in bushes, but sometimes, guys, it's knowing when you are in the worst situation, which over there, I mean, we have a ball with seven energy. Purely, I'm in a bad spot there. I don't want to be getting into that firefight, so just getting out of there, recognizing where I am, and it's Shelly. Okay, so Shelly, when she has a super, will be better. I don't think she's in these bushes. No, there she is. So if I can get close... Got her! With Shelly, you got to get close because Bull does a lot more damage up close. Whereas Shelly, if she has her super and she has the star power, she can slow you down and definitely she will take you out. So, two victories. I'm not going to lie, if the Let's Play kind of series continues like this, I'm going to be loving it, guys. Right. We're not going to play again because we're going to move to the next game mode, which is Heist. Let's have a look at the map. So... We kind of get funneled in through the middle and have to go around the side. Let's choose. I mean, who should we go with? You can let me know your favorite brawlers for heist down in the comments. Uh, let's go with Dynamite. I haven't used Dynamite for the longest time. I think the last time I used him is when we got the Christmas skins. Network issues. Come on. Right. Let's see what we can do here. So, let me know as well. Dynamite or Barley, what do you prefer? So what I need to do here is we have a couple of high HP brawlers, but very short range. So I need to stay back, basically take them out. Colt here needs to get out of there. Good stuff. I need to build up my super. That's what I need to do whilst taking out these brawlers, which are short range. Okay. Have my super now, but honestly, I don't really want to use it as of yet. Oh no, Cole took me out, and Bull is going to take the rest of my team out. This is not looking good. Gotcha, 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 gotcha. Did Cole go out? I think he did. Let's push up as far as, far as we can up the map here. Let's get that on the safe. Oh, no, 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 no. Should get El Primo. Oh, he jumped in ahead of me. Okay. Cool to get out of there. We need to heal up. Actually, we're not doing too bad. We've rescued this. We've rescued it. Far too often, though, guys, I see people diving in and not healing up. I'm actually going to just miss that El Primo. I'm quite happy that I can get some shots under the safe here. El Primo's on there. I thought my teammates would have got him, but it's not happening. Come on. Can we get this safe? Oh, boom. We got it. Auto fire for the win. I took a risk. Letting that El Primo get past us, figured there was two of my teammates v1, fortunately they took him out, and we did manage to get the safe, so this is awesome, we're doing quite well, we're getting the star tokens, no problem. Moving on to the final match of the video then, it is... Brawl Ball, a good mix of games for today. Let me know if you enjoyed the episode as well. Let me know if there's any changes to the Let's Play. What would you like to see? Again, this is purely me playing the game, and I will be bringing in the tips and tricks videos as well. But alongside these, I'll try and provide tips through it. Let's go with El Primo. He's one of my favorite for Brawl Ball. I just like to play aggressive in Brawl Ball, take down the enemy team, get that ball. It's going to be interesting with a Leon on the team, though. Definitely. So he does massive damage. I see that other El Primo. And let's just see what we can do here. Okay. Oh, I'm not feeling confident here. Oh, Leon absolutely crushed us, and it is going to be 1-0. That was totally my fault. Sorry to my team. Got completely mixed up there. Leon is invisible already. Let's see if we can get this El Primo out. Oh, no. That is going to be the defeat. I don't know what to say, guys. That was awful. That was completely awful. Brawl Ball tips. Drop them down below. Let me know. That was terrible, though. Wow, someone, one of these players wants to play again. We got demolished. I know I clicked play again as well, but come on, Anthony. You don't want to play again. Right, let's wreck it. Mortis down. Let's see if we can steal that ball and get out of there. Yes! Managed to sneak it through, guys. That was awesome. Got past Frank. Snuck that into the net. 
Let's see what we can do this time. El Primo jumps forward. See if we can get this Mortis. Because if Mortis gets past you, then you are history. And I think we're good here. El Primo is not going to get us. He's going to get taken out. Let's run it past him. Slide it into the net. So no sooner did we lose by two goals. We managed to get a victory by two goals just as quick. I hope anyone that switched off the video right after we lost them two Brawl Ball goals knows how much I came back and clutched it. That is going to wrap it up for this one, guys. If you have enjoyed it, be sure to subscribe to the channel. Hit the notification bell so you get notified as soon as my videos go live. And until next time, peace out.